Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm gonna show you how to unlock your Samsung SGHT219 for free. You'll do it yourself. And it only takes maybe like, what, like eight minutes or something. And the directions are all gonna be in the description and in the video. So if it's too fast for you, look in the description. And unlike a lot of these stupid YouTube videos, I'm not gonna leave you a site that's gonna charge. And look what they want, 25 bucks to unlock a phone that ain't worth that much. And this is for the SGH T219. Now make sure you find all, follow all the directions carefully because your phone may become locked and become useless if you're not careful. And all the directions will be in the description or you can pause it if it's too quick for you. Anyways, here goes how to do it. Insert a non-T-Mobile SIM card into your phone and turn the phone on. The phone will say wrong SIM. Enter the numbers that are below exactly how they appear. Then you should wait 15 or 20 seconds and you may get this message. Once your phone turns on again, at the welcome screen type in all this. Exactly how it appears with, this, with, with the pound and the stars and all that. Then enter this. After you enter this, the phone should be unlocked because basically you can test it by punching this in and it'll tell you if the locks are inactive. And it should bring up this window network lock, subset lock, all these locks that you see should be inactive at this point. Okay, so once you've done this, you may need to reboot your phone again, but be patient, it'll be searching for a while, and then you should get this screen. That means it's done, you know, once they AT&T or whatever your other GSM network was.